we're back with another one guys and this is the video review of the link dream bluetooth so you can barely see the bluetooth light so it gives you an idea that even under harsh conditions dark conditions you could barely see the Bluetooth this is the Bluetooth watch that I can honestly say is it's like it's possessed this Bluetooth will turn on when it wants to turn on it will link to your phone it will interrupt whatever Bluetooth you have if you're listening um, to you know to your phone regularly the Bluetooth would would connect you're making a phone call you wouldn't even realize that the Bluetooth is already connected to the phone it does it on its own because anything that touches this Bluetooth it automatically wakes up the Bluetooth and makes it connect to the phone now this watch wearing it as a watch without the Bluetooth attached to it it can look fairly ugly like it's truly missing something but I guess its purpose is once you um, using the uh, you're not using the Bluetooth you just plug it back in and it doesn't look like anything's missing but it's exactly not a pretty looking it's not a good look it's not a good look now this is the arm I wear it on because I have my Moto 360 and I wear this on the other side now this Bluetooth is for situations where I'm not gonna continuously wear a Bluetooth not the best looking device I can honestly say but it has its function this is this is a Bluetooth that you wear underneath your suit this is not a Bluetooth that you ne necessarily want to show if you work construction if you work a type of job where your Bluetooth might fall out your ears or you don't want to wear a Bluetooth continuous but you want to have easy access to your Bluetooth like I've been you losing a couple of Bluetooths because I put it in my pocket and somehow it jumps out of my pocket when I pull out my keys or I pull out something else and I've been losing Bluetooth so this was a good idea this is the reason I bought it this is the Bluetooth I don't mind losing in a way but I like all my Bluetooths. Now let's talk about this as a watch. Now as a watch, you just basically touch the side and you can get a quick glance at the time. Like right now it says 741. You constantly gonna, gonna have to set the time on this watch. But as a watch, it functions. Whether the Bluetooth is on it or not, as a watch, it'll show you the time, show you the battery life of the watch now the watch have a pretty long battery life I would say a couple of days but at the same time it's performing as a watch it can charge up your Bluetooth now when it charges up your Bluetooth the battery life on the Bluetooth itself will be shorter than if you charge them both together now what I recommend you charge up the base first then you charge up both devices together now that might find a bit tedious but if you want the full two to three hour time of continuous use on this Bluetooth you may want to do that now once it charges up once this Bluetooth charges up from the base it may last you a little bit more than an hour of continuous use before you have to put it back in its base so I can say the base can charge up the Bluetooth several times I would say maybe up to four times before it's really starts losing its battery life so and then you, you know so it should last you the whole day but you do have to put it back in its base when you're not using it to continuous be able to use this Bluetooth now I use several Bluetooths. This is not this is not my favorite Bluetooth because of the watch and because of the interference that it causes by linking to my phone, turning on when it 
shouldn't be on. But other than that, this as a Bluetooth, a standalone Bluetooth, works so well. The speaker on this works so well. It sounds so good. The feel, the comfort of this in your ear is very comfortable. It's light, it fits in your ear very snug. Either ear, I don't have no issues. It doesn't feel like it's gonna fall out. This Bluetooth doesn't fall out. So if you're working and I guess if you're doing construction and I do a very laborish job, if that's a word, but I, I, I do some heavy labor. So there's Bluetooth that's fell out my ear, like the Moto Hint, but this Bluetooth doesn't. So this is a, as a standalone Bluetooth, this is a very good Bluetooth. Let me give you a, a quick sound, a quick listen to the sound. So right from here, you can hear the Bluetooth. It's so comfortable. It fits in your ear very snug. So if you do want to, if you don't use a Bluetooth for long periods of time, this is a good Bluetooth. Now, it you you heard the sound it sounds good take my word it's very comfortable fits right in your ear real snug now if there's any negative i can say about this bluetooth is number one the watch is ugly it's not comfortable but it does its purpose it charges the device so if you want to put tuck this in your purse, take off the straps, tuck it in your purse. It charges by micro USB right there. Now I took off the rubber because it was annoying to pull this out every time you want to plug it in. So I just pulled it out altogether. But if you just want to use it as a base, I guess it would work just as a base. But using it as a watch, it has its drawbacks. But the Bluetooth itself, if the Bluetooth itself had a micro USB port where you could ch just charge this directly, this will be one of my favorite Bluetooth standalone. But this, it's a mixed review because it comes with a watch. So the watch factor is not really good. But the Bluetooth itself is fantastic. The battery life for the size the battery life is exactly where it should be. Uh, two to three hours of continuous use is good. It's not going to last you a whole shift at work. It's going to have to go back in its base and charge back up. So be prepared. This is a secondary Bluetooth. If you use Bluetooths like me, this will be your secondary Bluetooth. Definitely. So the Link Dream... 30 something dollars, you can't beat it. It's not a bad Bluetooth. Those are scenarios you could use it for. If, if, if you're the type of person you don't want a Bluetooth in your ear all the time, this is something you can use. Not bad at all.